everybody, it's me, Miss Bexa, and I'm, I'm putting my mask on so I sound a bit um, muffled. We have this lovely patient here, which I've done her other foot, and now it's just this massive thing, which she saw the dietrist, they didn't even know if it was a corneal callus, uh, if it was a corneal verruca. So I can't really tell because there's so much callus there, and she hasn't had this touch for a year. So I'm going to slowly, gently remove this. Okay, start. She's already moving because she's anticipating. I'm going to be very gentle. Uh, excellent. Uh, so I'm just removing the first la layer. So I need to have a look because it's very hard to tell, to be honest, for me too. Because sometimes if you have a corn for a very long time, it can develop into something that looks like a fruka. And sometimes a fruca can look like a corn too. So the most important thing is to look at the base. Sometimes you can get what we call a neovascular corn, which is a corn that digs into the foot and into the nerves, and they're extremely painful. So you might want to have one of those, actually. I think I'm having a feeling that actually it might be one of those. Mm, still looks like a corn to me. A wart you can potentially for it to go away. A corner will always be there. Yeah, come back. So I think a fruka is better <laughs> because you can potentially treat it and it can go away. A corn is just you have to like um, you will have to like um, get orthotics, maybe laser it. There's multiple things that you can do for it, but it, it's a very rare chance that it will really go away. Put it right so at, at night time when you're not busy thinking all you can concentrate is that thing and then it throbs and sometimes that's a neovascular corn too it looks like still a corn to me and it's massive
I think it's a combination of a corn and a bit of furuka tissue, to be honest. Because the bottom, at the bottom of the circle, on the bottom, there's little tiny dots of black dots in it. So I think you have a little bit of furuka with corn tissue. So you have the best of both worlds. So how do we treat this? <clears throat> we'll talk about it in a minute. And let's zoom out because I'm almost done. Thank you. So you can see there's quite a big lesion there uh, itself. Okay, awesome. All done. Thank you very much for watching. And uh, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe to my channel. Thank you. <laughs>